this lesson, we're going to add another element and this one is going to be a counter. So click on the counter and you see that counts up. Now these are really good when you can separate them and I'll show you what that means. So I'm going to click on apply here. You can choose uh, the color number. Let's click on apply. So what I mean by that is you can choose to add a column here and let's add, uh, let's make this four. Okay. So we're going to click to add new element and let's add a counter and we'll click apply. Let's add another counter again. And then we're going to change this one to 1000 and let's click apply. Let's add another counter and we can make this one 500. I'm just choosing random numbers here, apply. And we're going to use this one counter. Let's make this one 2000. So you can change them with this over here. So you can change uh, the information that you have. So instead of saying cool, you can say something like students. Apply this one. Uh, we're going to call this one here. Um, hours. So this gives you an idea if you wanted to have a cool countdown to how many students you have or how many hours or whatever unique way that you can be able to use for this. So I'm going to change this one to um, people. And you do this when you have it like this, then you can be able to have the counters go that one. You can pretty much come back here and scroll down. You can put on load and counter. So it counts down. And you can come for the style. You can change the color for that one. You can change the font. You can change the transform. You want it to be uppercase. And you can change that to be italic. You can change the spacing for it. See when I move, it's changing the spacing. So there's a lot of ways for you to be creative with this. Uh, you scroll down, you can choose the font weight uh, for the title. You can choose different colors for the, the title at the bottom. If you want to match it, that's fine. But if not, you can let that go. And the letter spacing, you can do that. So based on what you choose here, it's just going to give you the spacing for it. So sometimes you may want to be able to use that creativity and um, put things how you want it to be. So put the pad in. It's going to move it. So if you can link it now, what happened is that when you click on this link here, whatever number that you put is going to be all around. OK, so when I unlink it, then I can independently change it. So I'm going to click cancel. So this is a cool way, too, for you to add this counter um, on your site.